Jack Dyer was 35 years old when he played his last game for Richmond in 1949. As he took the field, both his knees were bandaged, so to his right wrist. Both thighs throbbed and ulcers swam in his mouth. Dyer no longer rucked. Instead, he positioned himself at full forward and led out no further than 30 yards, the total distance he could now kick. He had played 312 games across 19 seasons for 443 goals. His last match would be Richmond's last match of the 1940s, round 19, 1949 versus Geelong. His teammate, Havel Rowe, recalls that match. We played Geelong with Richmond and uh, he kicked six goals for the day. Mm -hmm. And one of them, the guy used to work for the police, was on the police force, and uh, one of them, he got the ball in the forward pocket. And uh, there were five Geelong players caught me. And he put up this big nip like a police and they all stopped. And he just kicked a goal from there, from the boundary. Uh, yeah, that presence, it was just incredible. Richmond won, and Jack Dyer, who had begun his career in 1931 on the bench, ended his career on the shoulders of his teammates. <laughs>